Hi guys, it's TC on Brentford here, back for another vlog. Uh, today we take on Luton Town um, at Griffin Park. Uh, they're near the bottom of the table, but it could be a potential um, banana skin. I've, I saw them on live on Sky Sports uh, a couple of times at the start of the season, um, and they look like they play quite well. Um, whereas for us, we're coming off the back of um, a loss, um, and we're a few points and few wins a drift of the playoffs, uh, which is realistically where I think we, we should be aiming and we should want to be. Um, yeah, we uh, lost against Blackburn away midweek, um, and we uh, and that was after the 1-0 win against uh, Reading, which I thought, thought was a really impressive performance. Um, I, I hope that we can get the, the results and the performance back on track today because... Um, because if we want to get uh, where we deserve to be and where our ambitions um, are, we need to start um, winning a lot of games. It's, um, it's uh, this, the time of the season where there's a lot of games coming thick and fast at the moment. So um, a good spell, a good um, few months um, with the momentum um, could, uh, could decide where we, we finish. Um, and I hope that we... Uh, we take this opportunity to um, to get as many points as possible and push up the table. Because um, I think we can. We've got the quality of players. Like, like Ben Rama is a fantastic player. That We've got loads of players like that that could um, that could potentially get in the championship team this season if they play well enough. Um, it's all about consistency at this time of year. And if we get that right, I really think that we can do um, do quite a bit this season. Um, yeah, I'll see you there, and come on, Brent. <laughs> Brentford uh, quite early on at Brian and Bumo. Um, yeah, we're shooting the other way this half um, than we would do uh, than we would usually do. But um, yeah, it's a mistake from the, the goalkeeper and the defence uh, of Luton, and we capitalised on it to score. Come on! The score of checking all. Ollie Watkins! Brentford's oh, second goal. Um, yeah, a really oh, good London. passing move. Finished off by Ollie Watkins, of course. Uh, he's the best player we uh, for this season so far, certainly. Come on, 2-0. Uh, um, yeah. I don't want to say we should be winning this, but we really should be at this point. Yes, sir! 3-0 Brentford. Come on! Wow! Silva! Silva! Just the silver with a fantastic curve on from outside the box. 4-0. What do you say? The score of Brentford's fifth goal, Josh Da Silva! 5 0. What a measured performance that was. And the uh, Luton fans are going to be 5 0. What a half of football. Uh, it's Aces, Damon Hampton, to Brian. I haven't seen Brentford's wife, Jan, Shonda, grandson, William, uh, for a long and time. The, uh, I haven't seen it that many times, but before half time is certainly 
a George unique Lambert, uh, occasion to George was fucking amazing. And also amazing. to Daniel Dudley, who's attacking with today. Like, to the most Daniel clinical Dudley. attacks I've seen in a long time. Just a while, uh, when we do the countdown, been finishing amazing, like, like everything in the final third has been going fantastically so far. Uh, we've just got to keep on uh, going and maybe we can add six, seven, eight. I don't know what score this could end up um, end up with, but yeah, 5 0 at half time. I can't praise the players enough for that half of football. Um, although saying that, Luton have been particularly shocking. I can see why they're in the, the, the position that they're in. Low in the table. I only said that it would be a potential banana skin at the start of the game because uh, it's the sort of thing Brentford do, go and lose against these lot, but teams like this, but yeah, we, uh, we're up 5-0 and I, I, I really can't see a way back in for it, into it for Luton. If they get one or two, that they'll be pretty happy with that, but um, other than that, fantastic off football. Just got to get some more and keep that clean sheet. Come on. That's the first time I've seen Brentford score six goals. Saeed Ben Rama with a fantastic penalty. Put the goalkeeper on the ground and rolled into the opposite corner. Come on! Seven nil, fantastic result, fantastic scoreline. First time I've seen Brentford score six and seven. Um, yeah, five nil by half time. What a result uh, to, to, to carry us into the weekend. Um, fantastic. Really enjoyed that one. It was testimonial football at the end. Come on. Uh, subscribe to TC on Brentford down below. Like if you don't like, turn away in the comments down below, and I'll try and fix it for next time. But come on. <laughs>